anda sebenarnya seorang ikon bagi masyarakat muslim bukan saja di Singapura ya tapi di seluruh dunia saya kira jadi tak sempurna kalau soalan ini saya tidak tanyakan kepada anda ya berapa lama anda ambil ya sebelum anda memeluk agama Islam dan kenapa anda pilih agama Islam ya uh, sebagai pegangan hidup anda uh, walaupun ada uh, kepercayaan lain yang juga percaya kepada uh, sang pencipta ya it is really only until uh, secondary school I was in Singapore uh, for primary school and secondary school education that I realized oh, okay people actually have very different faiths okay um, so I was in a Chinese stream primary school <laughs> so I don't have any Malay friends until I go to secondary school um, then I discover oh you know people have very different background very different faith and I become very curious because from young I was always asking what's the meaning and what's the purpose of life yeah so in religion we we find a lot of the answers to that question so over a very long period of time I slowly learn about the religion maybe about uh, 14 15 years ago I I officially convert yeah dan anda seorang saintis kongsi dengan kami ya sebenarnya apa kaitan antara agama dengan science hmm. Our religion always teaches us to seek knowledge, right? Because the the knowledge can be very useful uh, for our society, our community, and also I would say uh, a lot of scientific knowledge points again and again uh, to the existence of God. Yeah. So I think the two doesn't have problem with each other. People always ask me, is there a conflict between religion and science? I say no, not not whatsoever. For example, we are looking at bioengineering, right? Bioengineering is about learning about the complexity in a, in biology, okay? And sometimes we cannot fully understand everything, but we can easily uh, appreciate how complex the human body is, for example, right? What's the probability of that come to being by itself? Uh, the probability is really very very small. <laughs> so it's got to be a creator, right? That we are all born uh, in a manner that is really uh, fairly free from defects. Okay. Um, so this actually again and again affirms the, um, the existence of Allah. Right? I believe it wasn't difficult for me to actually accept uh, Islam. Mm. To me, it's a very simple religion. Um, it's much easier for me to accept uh, actually um, the other more complicated um, religious uh, concepts <laughs> so Islam is very simple religion but at the same time I think most people who are not familiar with the religion will be very very surprised to realize that um, how much knowledge there is in this uh, religion mm. So the depth of knowledge is tremendous. Um, when I first opened the Quran, I mean, it was very clear to me this book is very, very special and very unusual book. Yeah, because it has so much information in it that in those days, for example, the scientific knowledge would not have been um, able to describe in such details, and yet it was all in the Quran.